Hey, hello, you're stuck at Travel with Wolf Gordock, a few minutes riffing on IT and IT security. Today, looking at unconventional security controls, like puppies. So, if you didn't see the news, uh, San Francisco, San Francisco, California. In San Francisco, California, there's a high school, of course. And uh, high schoolers do what high schoolers do. Ever since, like, war games, every high schooler hacker has always had the same basic MO. Break in, change the grades. Hopefully impress the cute person that they want to impress. So in this particular instance, uh, they high schooler sent a phishing email using, uh, using some techniques to clone the website to make it look legit and was able to get a hold of the district credentials, logged in with those district credentials and changed the password for 16 people. Now the tip for you is this, the way they caught them involved a dog. And so oftentimes we stick with the very same controls we always do, why not think of something more unconventional? See, this San Francisco high school brought in the police. The police have a canine unit. The canine unit, and I didn't even know this was a thing, the canine unit is specifically trained to detect electronics. And this dog, we even know its name, it's Doug the dog. I love that, Doug the dog. This, this dog was able to sniff out the USB drive and pointed out to the police who were then able to confirm on this USB drive was phishing software including the templates for the emails. Doug the dog saved the day uh, along with the police and it reminded me of like the old days where we used to take the ISC squared test and be asked about geese. How often times have we been so focused on technical controls that we neglect weird things, cool things like a puppy. A puppy protecting the grades of students. Kind of cool. What type of uh, security controls would you think of that are uh, like unusual, outside the realm of normal? Hit me up. Comments. Social media. Cheers.